Hi, it's me, your host, Greg Kellogg, and I understand that we can't get to everything that you would like us to cover. However, if you leave a comment, we'll be sure to try to at least answer it in the comments. Also, if you would like and share this video and subscribe to the channel, we would really appreciate it. By definition, Thailand is a third world country. It's also classified as a developing country. The majority of Thai people work in the agricultural sector. That said, most Westerners, including Americans, see third world countries as basically poverty stricken hell holes. And to be honest, there are areas of poverty within Thailand. That said, the pictures shown here, the last two were taken from France and Detroit respectively. Or maybe it's the low salaries. The uh, average Thai family makes under $4,000 a year. Um, this chart shows you what some of the uh, em employee sectors bring in. But it, it's just not what we saw. When we were there, we saw, you know, modern facilities. We, we had half a kilometer away from us a mall called the Village, no, excuse me, Market Village Mall that we went to quite often because it was walking distance. A kilometer in the other direction was the Blueport Mall, which is a very new mall with a lot of things. We're going to show you some screens, some slides, and some movies about these different malls. Now, the Market Village was a little different outside before you got into it. It had a Starbucks, a McDonald's, a KFC, a Burger King, the things you would expect at a U.S. mall were all there, all present. And it had a kind of a courtyard you walked up and through to get to the mall entrance. By the second week we were there, they had converted that courtyard into an outdoor market of sorts for a lot of things as shown in this video. Um, after the video plays, I'm going to put on some music and you can just kind of go through the different things that we saw within the Market Village Mall. But suffice it to say, it is a modern mall with all the Western conveniences you would expect.
Market Village Mall is not the only modern mall in Wahan. There's also the Blueport Mall. The Blueport Mall is a multi-leveled facility that has a lot to do and see. You can buy groceries, even things that you would see in the U.S. You can uh, shop at different things. You can eat. There's a lot of restaurants. Janie and Yvette wanted pizza for their first meal, so I got them pizza. Janie ordered a drink that was... I don't know what it was. It was different. I didn't like it. She loved it. We traveled halfway around the world to get pizza. But there were a lot of options. We could have had other things from home like Cinnabon. I mean, there were just a ton of choices. And we did partake on other trips. The food was great. And there were a variety of tastes. But the thing that impressed me most with the Blueport Mall was the Whaley Port, an area set up just for kids. There was so much to see and do for the kids. There was, there were game rooms, there were video games, there were, oh, you name it, they had it, including a skating park. Can you believe it? Where kids can skate. And this was all set up so that the kids could have a good time while the parents took them to the mall. Now, it's important that you understand, it's hot in Thailand, almost year-round, very hot. And not all families can afford air conditioning throughout the house. The malls are air conditioned. You take your kids there and you can spend an enjoyable afternoon for the costs of whatever it costs to play those games. The kids run around and are happy and they're cool. So, you know, it's a multi-purpose type getaway. Whether it's cartoon characters or superheroes, Blueport has it all. They also offer entertainment from balloon tying for the kids to music for the adults. And if you get tired, there's always a place to sit, including massage chairs where you can relax for 30 minutes and get a massage while you're doing it. And if you're like me, you probably enjoy things like a koi pond to relax to. You might notice Tony Stark, also known as Iron Man, looming over my shoulder. This brings me to the last thing that I wanted to discuss concerning the Blueport Mall, and that's the Blueport Cinema. The Blueport Cinema offers a discount program for seniors. For 150 baht, you can get a senior discount card that allows you to get discounted prices throughout the week. The prices vary depending on the day of the week, but Tuesday nights are the best, 60 baht, $2 for a movie and new movies open on Tuesday nights. So I was able to see Deadpool 2 on Tuesday night. Now they do also offer a lot of the same things that you would see in the U.S., including Transformer heads for popcorn holders. Or if you like, you can eat Deadpool's brains, which is popcorn. Uh, if you can see the ticket, it shows clearly, it gives my name, it has a reserve seat, and the third line down from the big print in very small print is the price, 60 baht, just to show you that this is what I paid to see Deadpool 2. Not a bad deal, all told. Hey, if you liked the video, go ahead and click on the thumbs up for us, give us a like, and you know, as always, we would just love it if you would go ahead and subscribe so you can see all of our videos.